Hi everyone and welcome to another plan with me. Today I'm in my my A5 but it's my personal planner in that it's for just me not for work. Um, I have done a fairly extensive setup of this video of this planner so over three videos and here's my June spread and then in the weekly uh, this was last week and actually the week before last I didn't even film last week or plan last week in here I did it all in my B6 instead um, but I'm ready to dive into this week before I do I might just quickly show you what I have so far put in the rest of this planner so in the third section um, is kind of my career plan um, which is just a bunch of notes answering questions that I did on some online training and things like that and also um, I'm doing the life plan which is Shana Kennedy um, a book that came with um, the Kiki K collaborated on making a, a, a series from so um, there's a there's a book and then there is a um, workbook to go with that so actually I think it's just the workbook anyway there's I'm working through that slowly um, slowly but surely and then in my fourth section, I think nothing at the moment, but this is where I'm going to um, record inspiration, uh, ideas, things that come to me will come in here. Um, and I'm going to have a YouTube ideas section here, um, which is this cute little section. And then lastly, well, second last is um, our social media tracking. So I just have this kind of cover page that I had in a previous planner. Um, and then the final section is just going to be notes, just basic notes. So anyway, that's a rough um, walkthrough of what the plans are for this planner, if you will. So I'm going to take these pages out and I'll just show you the kit that I'm planning to use this week. In fact, it's not a kit, it's a bunch of kits. So, um, I, you know, as, I, as you probably know, I typically plan in my B6 and there's always leftovers. So, for, for example, this kit has five, one, two, three, four, five, six boxes left. And you can see from this spread, I only need five. One, two, three, four, five. Saturday and Sunday are too small for boxes. So, I won't, I, 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 this is all I need. Um, so the rest of the kit still has quite a bit left in it as you can see here this is the new beginnings kit from GP studio and just in case I need some other pieces I've pulled out the blush these two sheets from the blush crush kit and then these ones from the Annabelle kit I actually originally was going to go with the Annabelle which I'm just trying to find the full boxes are here it had four full boxes left, which are also very pretty. Um, let's see the colours together. These are more cool toned and more warm toned, I guess you could say. So if I needed, that was there. And I did pull this from the Sanctuary Kit because it has the dates that I need, because today is the 10th of June. But I think this kit that I have here has those days in it. Yeah, it does have 10 through 16. So I don't need that, just put that to the side. But what I do need is days of the week. So I'm gonna use these marble ones that came in the Annabelle kit. So lots of bits and pieces here. I might just put this to the side for the moment. And what I'm gonna do is my usual, put the numbers on the days and then pop those into the planner. So I'll just go ahead and do that. And I'll do that on fast forward. Okay, so there we have the days of the week down. Um, I'll put this deco aside for the moment and I'll just zoom you in a touch so we can get a bit closer to the action. Um, I do like the look of um, the glitter headers across the top. So last week I did full boxes across the top 
and then today and to do here this week I think I might put the boxes across the middle just for fun so I'm going to put let's see today's Monday the 10th of June and it's Queen's birthday holiday here in Victoria so hence I'm not at work so um, that's nice because it gives me time to actually sit down and do some planning I did a video yesterday that will go up tomorrow on Tuesday I think um, where I've set up a new planner not really as a planner actually you'll see um, it's planning for a trip uh, so it doesn't have the usual like agenda calendar kind of stuff in it um, yeah so I'm looking forward to showing you that one when it goes live tomorrow uh, this one I think so there is, are my full boxes and um, I'm gonna put these little strips across the top of each just because I can and I think I've said before but this planner is meant to be just for me for fun um, I will have it I do have it open on my um, table at home um, actually on the couch more than anything because you know I do watch a bit of YouTube um, and I like to just take some notes when I'm watching if I find anything interesting or motivational or inspirational to do um, it's nice to have have that there to take notes in uh, also just reflecting on the career path that I'm on um, anything like that I find that kind of quite fun to do all right so these are the little headers now I don't have very many of the to do today type headers I'll just quickly look through here I think I had to pull from another kit to find some in fact I can't find them ah yes here so from the Annabelle kit there were five todays left so I'll use those for the first half of the week I mean the weekdays it's nice having um, an extra day of the weekend isn't it um, I started a new I'm in the middle of a freelance job building a website and building a social media presence for a company and then I've also just I'm just about to start the same again for another company the first one's a psychology clinic so that's been really cool you know I have a scientific background with a bit of health as well so that's quite fun and interesting um, I feel like I understand it fairly well not super well but you know well enough to be able to contribute um, and the other company is a fabric store that wants to build an online presence so um, and that's very creative so that's kind of fun as well so yes lots of exciting things starting starting up at the moment now I could put I've got these two today's left here that I could use on Saturday and Sunday so I might as well. I was just going to use one of the, um, just use the little these headers, but since I have these, it doesn't hurt. And I think it doesn't matter that they're slightly different. They're different color to these ones, but they're the same color as this virtually. I think it doesn't matter because it's the weekend, which kind of is treated differently anyway. All right, so that's what we have there. And I thought, um, like I did last week, I might use the full box checklists, these down the bottom, just because I have them and um, I never ever use them. So I might as well use them up in this spread. My only issue is that little space there for a header. I don't really have any headers left, but I might use some washi perhaps. I'll just see once I've put this down how it looks and what I have to fill that in with. Now what I'm hoping is this planner helps me um, 
I'm suffering a little bit of no motivation at the moment. Although, um, having done these last few plan with me, I feel like it is kicking in again, which is nice. Um, but I tend to fall into the YouTube trap or the Netflix trap um, instead of getting some things done, which is a bit painful. So um, I, if I can just map things out a little, I think it'll help. Because at work, I do that, and I'm super organised at work. I, I get a lot. Of, I get a lot done. That's not coming up. So, you know, I really should try to do the same at home as well. Now, I have these little glitter headers that go with this kit, so maybe that makes sense to put down here. Um, and I think it's pretty clear when you have a heart checklist or a checklist of any kind that it's a to-do list. So I don't think I really need to write to do on there. Now all that's left is some bottom washi. Um, because I track meals and hours and things like that in my work planner, I don't really think I want to track them here. Um, and also I do, I, I do want to track my hours that I spend on the freelance work, but I have well, not yet, but I will have separate planners for them because I want to be able to, you know, uh, separate the jobs out a little. And I think I have mentioned that I have a little new planner coming um, soon, which is exciting. All right, so that's that. Um, for the in the today section, I did want to put down. Um, the videos that I plan to post this week. So I just want to find, I think there's three videos going up. Um, so I've got these three here, these three little flags with the glitter on them. So I'm going to use those. One here on Monday. Oh no, oh, I made a mistake. There's not one going up today. Oh, that doesn't peel very well. Uh, I think I'm doing Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday this week. Um, what that does mean though is that on Wednesday night I'm going to have to film a video because I've got one ready to go for tomorrow and then this one will go up on Wednesday. And then Wednesday night I want to film a midweek flip. So... Oh, that means me being organized enough or home early enough to do that. All right, so um, I do have things I want to get done. So today I'm going to put down something for um, one of these quarter boxes. I might half boxes even. I might use this one with a little coffee cup um, to say that I'm filming this video. And then I need to put one down on Wednesday as well to remind me to film Wednesday's video. Um, Thursday's video, I should say. And I do want to, let me see, I think I've got a groceries, yeah, this groceries one here. I did do a grocery shop this morning. Pumpkin soup is on the stove right now and the house smells pretty delicious. Um, I haven't done my laundry today and <laughs> all weekend even. Um, it's at midday. I probably can get it on today so I won't put down a sticker for the rest of the week. I think I'll just leave it there for the moment. All right and let's see what else do I need. That might be it for the moment. What I might do is just write some stuff in so I can better understand what's happening and I'll be back to see you in just a sec. Okay, here's where we're at so far. I don't love the Sharpie. It's just too thick, I find. Um, I don't know, I think it's just too dark. But it is what it is at this point and... Um, Sorry, now I can't speak. Um, it's all I can really use, as far as I know, to write on the um, vinyl, unfortunately. 
Okay, so while I'm here, I did want to put in a few things that I need to do on Tuesday morning or Tuesday at some point. I think there should be some checklists. I've got this little heart, heart checklist here. So just a couple of phone calls I need to make. So I thought I would just chop off a couple. I need to make th one, oh, just two, just two appointments. Okay. Then I might just use this. Could just have used those little glitter hearts, I guess, but I quite like this. So I've got a book in a car service, and I have to make a doctor's appointment. I'll try and do those on Tuesday. Now, um, next weekend, I need to put in a couple of things that I have to get done. Um, I'm going to use this little laptop. And I might put it on Sunday, I think. It's not really work. But I just want to remember to do, I've got, I'm going to do a finance planner. And I want to film an update on my Paris planner. Okay. And just this label is pretty crooked. Oh, that should do it. Um, okay, so I'll grab some of this New Beginnings Deco just to pop in here and there because um, I do want to, I will be putting some more things in here. I just want to um, just kind of wait how, to see how the week progresses a little bit first before I do that. Alright, so the last thing I want to do is put down some washi across the bottom. And I think what I have in these kits is not really big enough. So I'm going to grab some washi from my washi tower that's here in front of me. Um, I'm just trying to figure out the best for this spread. I really love this one with the red lips, um, but it might be a bit bold. For this. Yeah, the red's probably a little bit too much, although it is fabulous. Uh, there is no foil in here yet, so I could potentially add some foil. Um, I could use this Pale Pink XOXO um, on top of another one, or perhaps under a thin washi. Just having a look at what I've got here in terms of thin washi. Um, I've got this nice floral one that could potentially work, but mm, maybe not. I'll just grab this little pack I've got here. Uh, or maybe a black. Maybe this black spotty one would look good, but maybe not with the XOXO. What about with this purpley pink? the gold. Let's see how that looks. I reckon that could work. Let's give it a go. Now I probably should white out those lines but I don't really care. And it kind of looks like stitching between the bows in a way, doesn't it? Let's go with that idea. I'll just trim off this excess off both sides. And I'll put it down here as well. I think I've lined it up with with the um, second line there. And I don't want to cut this end, it's too difficult. 
So I'll just put that down like that. Oh, I do also want to put down a couple of things I want to get done cleaning wise this week. I feel like I have to give myself a schedule to do cleaning, otherwise I slack off a bit. Now tell me what you think about not getting rid of these lines. I don't, it doesn't bother me so much, I quite, I even like it in a way, but um, I could be biased because I don't really want to go through the hassle of whiting them out. <laughs> oh. Stuck it down a bit too soon. I have to do this upside down. I think there's no other way for me to do this neatly. Something about a black and white spot, spot I really quite like. All right, that's that. I think that looks pretty cute. And I could even um, pop in a bit of deco down there as well. I just noticed this little peony jar. I think that's pretty cute. I might put it down here. And this other little bunch of peonies here I could put on this side just there like that now I should have some kind of cleaning there is the organized sticker which I tend to often use for cleaning um, and there is a vacuum cleaner one as well which could be useful um, and then there's my planner there's a planner there which I want to use. Let's see, anything else amongst here that I want to use? No, I think. Oh, there's a bit of deco here on this Annabelle sheet that I quite like, so we might look at that as well. All right, so I think I'll just put down the organize here on Thursday and I will do my planner I'll just put it on Saturday Saturday and Sunday are, are synonymous for me really they kind of end up being virtually the same and I'll put this little cleaning sticker now it doesn't really matter what what day I put it on because um, I need to do it throughout the week anyway um, and I've not left room for a tracker. Maybe I can squeeze this tracker in on Saturday morning. Even Friday. Friday's completely empty, isn't it? Yeah, I'll put it there. And I'll quickly write on it while I'm here. This is my 15 minute tidy. So for organize, I want to go through my stationary drawers. Um, I'll just put go through my drawers because the top three are stationary, then I've got tools. <laughs> um, and under that, I've got another little section of like travel bits and pieces and stationary. And uh, then in the very bottom, I've got even plates and stuff like that, big plates that don't fit anywhere else. So it's all a bit of a mishmash, really. All right, so that, I think, covers my week. Friday's empty because, well, it is. Um, I don't really know what I'm going to get up to on Friday. It's sort of too far away for me. I'll do the plan with me on Saturday. And I just want to throw in this little coffee cup here on Tuesday because we will go out for coffee and I love these sunnies I think I'll just scatter them or at least one set on the weekend oh they're so cute um, 
and I might put the big ones on Friday. I think I like the idea of having them layered over this little box here. Alright, so that's that. I might just put down a couple of these hearts on Friday for whatever might pop up. If anything does, then that's great. If it doesn't, it doesn't matter. And you can see I've left my to-dos pretty blank. For, well, blank, completely blank for Thursday and Friday. Because I don't really know how that end of the week is going to turn up, turn out. Um, I'll just grab my usual little stash of Tickle Pink, etc. here. See if there's anything that I want to use. Um, probably not, I guess, because I have packed it pretty full. I have these couple of to-dos that could have gone across here, but I don't think I need to bother about that. Um, and the other thing is this top priorities box here on the side, whether to fill that in or not. Um, let's see. Maybe, maybe, maybe. I'll just grab this pile of stickers back again and see if I can find another header. So I'm just thinking about, here's this gold one, about that top priority section. I might cover up the words with this header. And I'm going to put one of these gold stickers across the top instead. Like so. And what I'd like to do is just have three. So I'm going to cover up the bottom. Now, if you remember correctly, these kits come with those little strips. Let me just find my new beginning rings. Find the washi page. The washi page comes with um, these strips here. I didn't realize that, that was it though. I really wanted a diff I wanted a set of colors. Uh, uh, a pattern, sorry. Okay, in that case, I'm going to cut down this one with the sunnies. I want to put it down the bottom here. So, I need the first three to show. And it's just that tiniest bit too long. So I'll just cut a little bit off the bottom. And then... Yeah, that should do it. So I will just put this here, like so. And for my top three goals, I'm going to put my two freelance jobs. So um, will I call it kitchen? I think I will. I think that's the bit that I really need to work on the most at the moment. That's that. I wonder if I can just move this box slightly. I cannot, but I can white out the edges. That little bit of extra white um, black lines here was a bit too harsh for me. So I'll just run the white out down the side here. Oh, that's awful white out. Mighty Mini is not so mighty. Okay, there we have the week. Sorry, I'm pausing. I got in trouble once from someone who <laughs> reported to me. Um, he said to me, why do you always pause when you speak? Are you trying not to say bad things about me? And I thought, how rude. I mean, I, I, it's just the way I am. I can't help it. Okay, so I'll put this back in the planner and I'm loving the colours, as I'm sure you know. Pink is my colour. Put in this little clip that my friend made me. And there we have it. There is the week ahead in my Kiki K A5 Thrive Pink Lavender. I think it's come together really nicely. I really want to, this week, make an effort on working on these to-dos and... and um, figuring out what to do the next day and the next day and the next day. So 
Um, I finally cleaned my space, uh, organized my space in the living slash dining room. It's a very small space, but um, I do all of my planning here in the kitchen. So, dining room. So, um, I've cleaned that out to have it as a space I can use for planning um, all the time. So, that's really good. So, it looks like I've got quite a few things to get done today, um, but it's only midday, so that's good. Um, I'm going to, just for fun, write in here pumpkin soup, because I've made a lot, I think, and it should last me um, for dinners for the week. We go out for lunch, as I'm sure you know, if you've watched me for a while. So, um, it's really only dinners I need to take care of, and I think I can manage to have pumpkin soup every night of the week. I don't think that's going to bother me at all. All right, guys, that's it for me. Thanks so, so much for watching. I really appreciate it, as you know. And I look forward to seeing you again for the next one. Okay. Thanks, guys. Bye.